guys, Spotify recently sent out a survey to users asking them how they would feel about a subscription podcast plan. The survey describes four different options. The plans range from three to $8 per month. The lowest plan would give users exclusive interviews or episodes, but still include ads. On the flip side though, the highest plan gives users access to high quality original content and includes no ads and early access to some episodes. Now, this really shouldn't be a surprising move for anyone, right? Especially when you consider the investments that Spotify has made over the past few years. They already own Soundtrap, which is widely used to produce podcasts. And just this week, it was announced that they will be buying podcast ad platform Megaphone for $235 million. Bottom line is Spotify is looking to use podcasts to separate itself from everyone else. And by that, I mean Apple Music. Spotify is already dominating the music game. They have over 50 million songs in their catalog, a free ad supported tier, and a student plan that everyone loves. On top of that, you can listen to it anywhere and on any device you want. It is only right that Spotify is looking to dominate the industry once again with podcasts as well. They have already secured deals with Michelle Obama, Kim Kardashian West, and Joe Rogan to exclusively stream their content. A subscription podcast service is in the works for Spotify. That only means big things for the app.